Johnny Depp and Dwayne Johnson have been chosen for the same iconic film role. Although Dwayne Johnson and Johnny Depp are two very different actors with different skill sets and ways to accepting new parts, they were both considered for the same classic film role, but only one could end up landing the job. Johnny Depp and Dwayne Johnson are two of Hollywood's most skilled, productive, in-demand, and well-paid performers. One started out as far from Hollywood as possible, in the ring as a professional wrestler, while the other started out as a musician who started his acting career as a teen heartthrob in the middle of the 1980s. Johnson and Depp are renowned for their amazing abilities to produce one box office hit after another. Johnny Depp and Dwayne Johnson are two of Hollywood's highest paid performers ever. Depp reportedly made $55 million in 2011 for his performance as Captain Jack Sparrow in Disney's Pirates of the Caribbean, on Stranger Tides, and $68 million the year before for his portrayal of the over-the-top, slightly insane, slightly depressed Mad Hatter and Tim Burton's Alice in Wonderland. Dwayne Johnson held the record for highest-grossing actor in 2022, earning $270 million in just one year thanks to several blockbuster hits like Red Notice and Black Adam. Yet these two fan favorite celebs share more than just that. Depp and Johnson both made Tim Burton's short list of potential actors for his Charlie and the Chocolate Factory adaptation of Willy Wonka, according to an Instagram post by The Rock. According to the post, Tim Burton had contemplated casting me as Willy Wonka in his remake of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. I distinctly recall thinking, holy, I'm in. But it was many years ago, when I was just getting started in Hollywood and lacked the necessary acting chops or a solid global box office base to even attempt it. Naturally, Johnny Depp won the part because he was the biggest star in the world at the time. Johnson continued by expressing gratitude in his article for even being given the chance to be considered for the position. Johnson commented, I was just getting started in the profession and had no idea what the future had in store, so the fact that Tim even considered me sure meant a hell of a lot to me. I'll always raise a glass in honor of unfulfilled goals because, on occasion, they represent the best thing that could have never happened.